Yeah, I'll go check out my boy Mac Blast. Uh, he got a got a um a channel called Hustle and the Empire. Hustle and the Empire. I might put it in the description. But uh he he basically like a Bay Area version of Terrence Gangster Williams. You know what I'm saying? He down right now, he be doing a bunch of um videos from jail. Y'all need to go check him out. But he talking about this one where it's it caught my title because it I mean it caught my eye because it said ain't no crips in richmond that was one of his things and he wasn't dissing he just was saying you know uh he already broke this down before um it's no bloods and crips in richmond only the north Daniels and serranos and then they're not even like bloods and crips they 13s and 14s the bay area is like new orleans like if you want to know how the bay area blocks and how the streets and all the gang shit is set up, it's set up just like New Orleans. How people from somewhere, they bang a block, they bang a street. There's usually hustling going on. In the Bay, we call it, it's not beefing, it's funking. You feel me? Like, But ain't no bloods and crips in, we say blood, we say cuz, we say all that. But ain't no bloods and crips in Richmond. Uh, type in Mac Blast, y'all go follow him. He break down the Bay Area politics. Uh, the Bay Area has just been overshadowed by L.A. for a while, but it's not for like, it's not because L.A. way roared in the Bay. It's just the, the, the L.A. got more notoriety. Kind of like I compare the Bay Area and L.A. to Baton Rouge and New Orleans. Baton Rouge has been like that for a long time, even while New Orleans was like that. So if you meet people from Louisiana, you like, you from the N.O.? They're like, no, nah, I'm from the B.R. I'm from Baton Rouge. And people used to be like, oh, he ain't from the N.O., so he ain't, it's cool. Nah, Baton Rouge, then they're just as bad as the N.O. People just don't know about it. That's how the Bay is. The Bay just like L.A. Might be even worse. L.A. niggas starting to know about the Bay. They use our slang. They kind of use our game a little bit. Ain't no gang banging going on in the Bay. Mac, Bla Mac Blast, break this down. Uh, it ain't no six folds and hydraulics and flannels and ben davis and all that it's different like the bay area is kind of like new york we kind of dress like new york mixed with like the south that's how we dress in the bay um but there ain't no bloods and crips out there mac blast will tell you that mac blast was on hood to hood back in the day uh the bay is totally different the bay remind me of a california new orleans richmond and oakland like california versions of new orleans that's why I click, like a lot of people from the Bay don't know, New Orleans fuck with us tough. Like New Orleans, like the Bay, the Bay, you from the Bay? You know what I'm saying? And Detroit fuck with the Bay. Like if you notice, a lot of out of town places fuck with the Bay. Philly fuck with the Bay. Baltimore fuck with the Bay. I meet people from everywhere. I'm like, oh yeah, man, I'm from the little place called the Bay Area, man. I'm from Rich. We know about the Bay. It didn't used to be like that. Everybody would thought LA was, oh, y'all bloods and crips. Nah, it's, it's, it's. It's just as turned up as L.A., but it's no bloods and crips, man. It's just a couple niggas from each block holding it down. It's just totally different. The Bay is totally different from L.A. The music, we all kind of got that funk, but it's like our funk is different from their funk. I mean, as far as music, you know what I'm saying? Like, the way, the way we ride the funk wave is different than how they ride the funk wave. Uh, but, yeah, man, ain't, ain't no, ain't, I, ain't, I ain't never met no... Messy Marv did that shit, but it's like, you see the backlash he got? You know, ain't no bloods and crips in the Bay, period, man. Uh, Bay Area politics, like I told, like told y'all, it's more like New Orleans, more like, I wouldn't say Chicago because they ain't gangs, GDs, and BDs. Like, ain't none of that going on. In one neighborhood, it could be 15 gangs. Ain't nobody tied into nothing. They all separate gangs from one side of town that could end up beefing with each other. Like, like Richmond, South Side and North Side, Central. Well, South Side they kind of clicked up with, with North a little bit, but like Central and North Richmond beefing. It's hoods and Central that beef with each other, but it's it's guaranteed beef with some parts of the South Side, some parts of North, some parts of North Richmond. It's guaranteed. It's it's generational. It's been like that since niggas was born. You know what I'm saying? Um, but it's it's just kind of like that. Central, South Side, everybody got, got their own side. It ain't it ain't like it's no no little group gang that's in South Side that's tied in 
with this group gang over here. Like it is to a certain degree, like street wise, clicks, clicks, beef, uh, clicks, uh, click up with each other. But like for the most part, it ain't no clicking up. Everybody is their own separate entity. Ain't no ties. It might be one street fuck with another street or one, but that's it. It ain't a bunch of affiliation like the way LA is. How it's these crips over here cool with these crips over there and then these crips tied in. It ain't none of that. The bay is completely separate. You know what I'm saying? 